Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I've had this bag of goodies over a month now in my room, just like on my floor and I've been looking and I'm like, I wanna like open you up and play with you already, but I've been trying to be good just so I can get a really nice haul for you guys. So it's going to be a collective haul. So we got a lot of stuff in there, so we're just gonna move right along. So the first thing I got, I got a Clarisonic head. A new one. Um, I was gonna get the delicate one, but it was suggested to me to get the sensitive one, which is the same one that comes with the original uh, Clarisonic that you get when you get by the Clarisonic. And I really like that one, so I didn't mind getting this one. And it's already been like about three months because I think I got mine in like November. So I got one of those. And I'm really excited. I got two nail polishes from Sephora which I'm really excited about. Uh, these are especially for like the summertime. This one is called Power Source which the camera kind of doesn't even really give it justice because it's a lot brighter in person. It's like a beautiful pinky coral color. It looks a little red on camera. And then I got another one which is this beautiful lavender color. This one is called, this one is called Outrageous. Well, so I'm really excited to paint my nails with those. Another thing that I got was the uh, Beauty Blender because my lovely dog did this to mine, which made me very upset. And it was kind of dingy and dirty anyway, and I just kind of wanted to get a new one, so. And for my 100 points perk, I also got the Beauty Blender Cleanser, which I've never tried before, so I'm really excited to try this, uh, see how well it cleans it, because I usually just clean mine with um, water, and soap and water. So we'll see how well that actually cleans the Beauty Blender. So I actually got a few eyeshadows uh, four are from the Sephora brand and one is from Buxom. Okay, so this first one I saw and it was so freaking pretty. It's this matte bright green one. This one is called Fresh Lime Limonade. Lime, yeah, Fresh Limonade. You're gonna focus. There you go. Really cool thing about the Sephora eyeshadows is that they actually really improved their formula. They're a lot more pigmented, they're a lot more butterier and like creamier but they went down in price so they're only ten dollars instead of twelve which is really not bad I mean when does that ever happen where like the quality of the product goes up but the price goes down that like never happens here's the eyeshadow one more time I was just like thinking about this one with like browns in the crease I think that would be like really pretty so that is it just an awesome like lime green color which is gonna look so pretty on the lid. So the next one I got is a shimmery eyeshadow, which is this beautiful purple. It's like a lilac purple. And this one is called Friends Selfie. That's that right there. I don't know if you can see it. But it's this beautiful, like shimmery lavender color. I'm really excited about that one. So the next one I got is another purpley one. This one is called Getaway. And this one is also a shimmer. They're just so smooth and just like really creamy, which is awesome. This one's a little bit more of a darker plum purple. Well, not plum, just for like a regular purple. But it's also shimmery as well. There's the swatch of it right there on my finger too, so you could really see it. It's so freaking pretty. And the last one I got of the Sephora eyeshadows is another shimmery eyeshadow. And this one is called Morning Freshness. This one is so pretty because it's like a pale champagne shimmery eyeshadow. I don't know if you can see that, but it's right there. And the one from Buxom, and this one is called, this is like a, a shimmery green, and this one is called Room Service. And this one has like a gold undertone to it, which is so pretty. It just reminds me of like a mermaid. You can see that. So those are the, all the eyeshadows that I got, which I'm really excited because I'm gonna put them in my Z palette. The next thing I got is actually a Sephora uh, eyebrow pencil. I'm gonna open it up so you can see. This is waterproof and it's in Midnight Brown, if you can see that. Now the spoolie is like crap. Like you're not gonna be able to do anything with that. But I have a spoolie, a separate spoolie of my own, so that's okay. In the store, it looked pretty pigmented, and it looked pretty easy to, like, apply. That's the color right there. 
We'll see how it goes. If I don't like it, I could always return it, which is awesome. So, so the next thing I got was actually a uh, Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Um, I was running out of my um, Urban Decay Anti-Aging Primer. I figured I'd just get a new primer, well, because mine's almost done. They repackaged it, like they made it, um, the packaging different. But it's really, really pretty. I really like it. So it's just a regular old eye primer. It's the 24-hour Anti-Crease Eyeshadow Primer by Too Faced. So I was really excited about this one. This one was a little bit more expensive. And I've been wanting it for a while, so I was just like, I figured I'd get it. It's the Laura Mercier Matte Radiance Baked Powder. So basically a highlighter. I'm gonna take it out. This is what it looks like. And I like it because it's like a little dome-like. But I'm pretty sure like it's gonna take a while to really dent that in. So I'm pretty sure that'll last me a while. It just has pink undertones. It's a really pretty shimmer if you can see. I don't know if you can see that. But I think that's absolutely gorgeous. It's gonna be really fun to play with that. And the last two things that I got are two liquid lipsticks, what I'm so excited to, <laughs> I'm so excited to play around with and have on my lips. So the first one is the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. I got this one in Exorcism. It was between Exorcism and Vampira, and Vampira is more of a red base, like a dark red, and then Exorcism was more berry. So I really do like more berry toned lipsticks, so I went with this one. It's just absolutely gorgeous. It's like brand new. Ooh. So that is a swatch of that. Just a beautiful berry toned color. So pretty. And the last thing that I got is my very first uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick. And I got it in American Doll. I'm excited about it because it's just, it's literally a classic red matte lip. It's just a great like candy apple red. That is um, American Doll. And you can see it's just a beautiful red. That'll be great for like any look, like a pinup look, or just like if you want just that classic bold red lip. It's gonna be awesome. So yeah, that is everything that I got. Um, I'm super excited to try out everything and play with everything, so. There's no more stuff in there. You know, it sucks because you feel like you spent a lot of money, but it doesn't seem like you got enough stuff. But I think that's like any makeup junkie just feels like I want more <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching I really appreciate you guys watching uh, hit the like button for me if you really like this video please subscribe if you haven't already uh, I will definitely be coming up with makeup tutorials with the eyeshadows that I recently got thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next one bye you don't shut up Mr. Fluffy again. Kitty. Hello. Another viewer. Just this kitty. It's like I feel like Mary Poppins just like digging in, grabbing all this stuff. The really cool thing about the new Sephora. Come on. Gorgeous too, because it's like a sh Oh, you can't even fucking see that. <laughs> what if this was like a style? Like, do you like my hat? It's just new from Sephora. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't hit stop recording. <laughs>